Hey guys, <clears throat> Archie Luxury, Archie Luxury on the Archie Luxury live streaming channel, live stream, Archie Luxury live stream. And uh, today, guys, tales of woe and misery. I've decided I am not cool enough to have the paddock world time. I want to sell it. I'm going to sell it. I'm selling it. So um, I put a few feelers out there. And uh, I, I just, I just not cool enough to have it. I mean, I'm a jeans and joggers sort of guy, not really a um, a three piece suit. So uh, it's time for it to go. I think it's time for it to go, guys. It's time for it to go. Um, I've got to tell Tan about this. I don't know how he's going to quite take this, but we'll see what he says there um some really nasty fuckers around i must be honest with you there uh some really 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 nasty cheap foul mouthed fuckers out there in the uh the watch game uh pump the brakes back the truck up um I'm going to sell. Lewis Toledo, I'm going to sell my world time. I'm not cool enough to pull it off. I'm not cool enough to pull it off, okay? I'm a steel. I'm a steel stunner, guys. Steel stunners. That's what I like. I like the steel. Steel stunners. Um, <clears throat> I want to do the steel stunners. So it's, uh, yeah, that's basically how it goes. The steel stunners. That's what I want is the steel stunners. So um, I've been, I've had some really nasty fuckers, real nasty fuckers on the, on the, um, the sales, uh, the gum tree. There's some real shitters there on the gum tree. Um, I've been offered all sorts of dodgy swaps. It's just, it's really pretty fucking, fucking crappy. It's really fucking crappy. It's not easy. What can I say? Uh, it's just, just how it is, man. It's just how it is. It's, it's very tough. It's very, very hard. It's very hard indeed there. There's some really nasty nasty fuckers out there and uh i gotta be honest with you uh all sorts of scammers all sorts of jerks they're all out there i still haven't moved that hydro naught that tuna 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 guess what the links came in the links came in on the hydro naught and uh here we go hydro naught Fuckers! Look at that. It fits. It fits. The Hydra Nort fits. Um, I got to tell you, that is one ugly watch. One ugly watch. Um, so I, I got to be honest with you there. It's, it's, uh, uh, I haven't had any fucking bites on the Hydra Nort. Um, yeah, the hair's getting thinned. It's thinned. I'm an old, middle-class, lower-middle-class guy. What do you expect, man? A middle age! It's all passing me by. Um, So I've got to be honest with you there. I'm wearing the Tudor! I'm wearing the Tudor. The Tudor. Um, I got the Lynx. It's it's good. It, it, look, it's filler. It fills up a oh five dollars from Gucci man. Hey Arch, I managed to purchase two subs this year for retail. A bluesy and a no date, both two thousand and eighteen. Did I buy too many subs, Gucci man? You can never have too many subs. I think I made the stupid mistake. I listened to a friend. Don't listen to friends. Friends are not friends, indeed. Friend said to me, I got a gold sub and I had a uh, a no date steal. He said, ah. Oh, You'd no point having two subs, but it just always goes bad. It always goes bad, man. I was an idiot. I should have kept it because that no date two line 
they're very expensive. They're a $10,000 thing now. Um, so I, I don't know what to say. It's just absolutely, it's a disaster. Absolute disaster. Let me just say that it's an absolute disaster. Uh, I, I, my advice to you is to be very, very careful. Just cool it. Uh, Archie, should I buy a Nautilus? Hey, Jay, send us some bucks. Send us some bucks, man. If you're asking those sort of questions, no free advice. That's for fucking sure. Freebies. There ain't no free advice, Jay. Um, Panerai makes a comeback due to no Rolex availability. That could be the case. Let me show you the steel stunners. The steel stunners. Actually, I got to send a. I got to send an. A text message to Tan. Where the fuck is my Tan? Live show. Live show now. Send that. I want to send one to Jin Vintigne. I just got to get some troops. Live show now. Uh, who else is there? I still got there. Okie dokie. That's the main antagonist. Okay, let's have a look. This is the Steel Stunners. Steel. This is Steel Stunners, fuckers. There we go. Ten Steel Stunners. Steel Stunners. Steel Stunners. Tudors, Omega, Hydronaut. Look at that. You can see the... The Hydro Nort doesn't seem that out of place. Breguets, Explorers, I Ingies. It's all happening. It's all happening, guys. Um, it's all happening. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Steel Stunners. That's the Steel Stunner collection steel stunners that's my steel stunners hey that could be the case tan and gin are in a watch show they don't tell me nothing i sent an invite to mark the goldberg the dog trainer the dog trainer he hasn't come back yet either he's the dog trainer I sent invites to all these people. Um, what can I say? What can I say? Um, what can I say? It's all very, very hard and nasty. All very hard. We need some super chats. Come on, guys. Super chat now. Hello. Super chat, fuckers. Hello. Hello. Woody, New Yorker, 199. Thank you. AC, how did your week go? In a Brit accent again. It was fucking lovely, fatters. It was fucking lovely. It was a disaster. This week was my birthday. Birthday. I turned 46. Middle age, here we go. It's all down here. All down here from now. Um... What can I say? It's all downhill indeed. It's all fucked us. It's from the Latin. Fucked I fucked us. To be fucked in a fucked state. It's all been pretty bad. Um, it's been a hard week. Very, very hard in, indeed. Uh, we had the sucker horn on. We did a pre-show. That was going well. This one here ain't going so well. It's sinking. Hey, Charlie.
Hey, we hit an iceberg. Uh, what else can I say? Oh, $5 super chat from Blue Shirt Buddha. Don't sell the paddock, Arch. You'll miss it. You'll miss it as soon as it's gone. When will you ever have a chance to own again? Very good point. Lewis Toledo, $5. What did you get for your birthday, big boy? I got some presents from some fans and some chocolates. I got some nice presents, I must admit. It was not a bad year. Uh, but I got to be honest with you. It's all downhill. Neo, $5 super chat. What will the watch market be like in 46 years? Let me tell you this much. I can tell you one thing for sure. I possibly wouldn't be alive, Neo. That's the sad reality. The sad reality. Daytonas will be strong. It's going to be a very interesting market indeed. So, uh, oh, yeah, that's a, a, it's a very interesting thing. Um, whist watches, whist, 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 whist watches. I love my watches. I do love my whist watches. I love my whist, whist, whist watches. Um, Patrick Seuss, good morning. Hey, Patrick. Yeah, no, it was, it, look, look, I gotta be honest with you. In all honesty, there, I've decided to get rid of the paddock. Woody New Yorker, what's worse, buyer's or seller's remorse? I think. Ooh, I think seller's remorse is worse. <sighs> seller's remorse, Woody. I got to tell you the truth there. I'm thinking about getting out of the paddock. Okay, let me tell you this seriously. The paddock is so much money. They've shot up. Contrary to <clears throat> another YouTube person who buys views said, um, the prices have shot up. $5 super chat from Blair Maskinlin, Maschichelin, Maschichel. What do you think of a pre-tag Hoyer 1000 for 696 Canadian? It's quartz but mint. I don't particularly like any. I don't particularly think they're any great. They're just a cheap, nasty Hoyer. You want to get a Hoyer? Not a tag Hoyer. I, 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 can't, I don't see any great value. 700 Canadian, still a lot of money. No, I wouldn't do the deal. Louis Toledo, Arch, man, cannot live without a Patek Philippe. Which one will you trade the world time for? Good question. Marky, Marky, Marky. Archibald Chesterfield the third, <clears throat> sir. Hey, I got your address. I'm going to send those two pockets out for you. Thank you. I've got yours. I've decided... I am not cool enough to have the Patek Philippe. I was uh, I was personally saddened by that decision, but financially it might make some sense. I've decided to sell it, okay? Because I got to be honest with you, I don't really I don't fit into the suits. The suits I used to wear with it don't fit, and um, I I'm kind of more of a I like <coughs> steel steel sports watches. Does that make sense? <clears throat> it does, although. You're going to miss this one. You, you loved it, so. I got to tell you, I'm thinking about if I sold it for the certain money, I could get, let me just run this by you, Steel Daytona. Mm. Steel Daytona pre-ceramic. You could have two of them. And a bluesy, and a bluesy sub. Yeah, you could. It's true, you could. Or how about a bluesy sub and a five- 196 Calatrava. So I still have a paddock, but I also have a bluesy. Yeah, it's a, and not only that, it would be a much cheaper watch to service when you need to. But I, I have very quickly, I must say, I love you dearly, but I'm a little cheesed off with you, Pontiff. Why is that? Well, remember all the grief you gave me for not acknowledging you as the El Primo? Yes. Okay. Yes. So apparently our deal is if one of us has a watch and the other yes, gets it, yes. we're supposed to acknowledge the influence. Yes, of course. And you have a burgundy black bay, I realized, and I had a burgundy black bay well before you. And you never, and you never 
quoted me as the, and I made multiple videos, of course, because I, you know, I owned it and I flogged like 10 or 12 videos out of that thing. And then I yeah, flicked it. Yeah, as you do, as you do. Well, I, I am apologize. I, I'm sorry. I am. Um, I'm teasing. I'm teasing. No, that's okay. I got to tell you the truth. Holy shit. 42 mil Explorer 2. That is a cool watch. That is yes. far, far out. That's cool. Speaking of uh, cheesed off, I, I cheesed off all my viewers by teasing them and not well, telling them. Five dollar super chat, Lewis Toledo, Arch Bluesy and Pre Ceramic Daytona is so ten years ago. At least get a Aquanaut, big boy. I can't afford an Aquanaut. Do you know how much they go for? That's the twice. Aquanaut. Yeah, you need two of those That's... to protect yourself. Ah, oh. what? I, I, I'm I'm actually trying to list it for twenty seven thousand US dollars. What do you think of that? Well, um, because it's box papers, box papers, and a paddock service. Oh, yeah. Tan's just texted me. He's traveling tonight. Okay. And the Ginster no is in worries. at the watch meeting. The Ginster is at the watch meeting. I know, he's at the watch meeting, is he? What are you going? I heard a rumor to that effect. I live in Chicago. It's you know, it's not close. So I've got work obligations, people to see, watches to fist. Yes. Um, I'm going to upset you when I tell you the price that I paid for this, I think. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Well, what do you think would be a good price? It is not box paper, but it still 5, has... 5000 US? Oh, no. no, you can't get them for that. Dix. But I did pay 62, 6200 That is a bargain. 62 yeah. is a bargain. It's a good price. Still has the factory sticker on the back. What happened to the box and papers? What the fuck did this idiot do? People, you know, people don't know. Normal people, you know, normal people don't know. They don't care. They lose that stuff. Yeah, I don't know. Anyway, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to, I can get a box on eBay for under $100. And then all I need to do is take it you to the You need to get the latest box. You need to get the latest box. Yeah, yeah. yeah, the current, the current one. Mm -hmm. I just saw one for like $79 on eBay. And, yeah. uh, but uh, then as far as the papers go, I'll take it to the authorized dealer and I will have them authenticate it, and I will ask them for an appraisal. Which I don't think you need papers. Why do you need papers? What the hell do you need papers well, for? Well, you know, because we're collectors and we like the bits and pieces. That's all. Yeah, That's but all. I'm getting a Milgau soon, right? And it also doesn't have papers, okay? But you know what? I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. It's a Milgau. So it's a real what, $2 super chat. Brian LP, sell the Patek. By the Grand Seiko Peacock. No, it does have the word cock. Mm. I mean, pee. I don't know what yeah. to say, but I got to be honest with you. Um, I don't think I'm cool enough to have the paddock anymore. Well, I, I don't, don't think have... you're, rich enough. you're cool. You're definitely cool enough. You're just not rich enough. No, those things have gone up. Like jokes aside, I actually asked a dealer in in Australia how much. He's a really nasty dealer. He was almost on the money. He, 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 I can't. He said they've really gone. It's funny. You know, the thing I find so funny is when I got it, people said, "Oh, it's a little bit too small." It's this and that. They criticised it. Mm. Now these same dealers are saying, "Oh, that's a very rare reference." Yeah, but, it is. It's a very complicated watch. That's what they've said. That's exactly what they've said. So I got to be honest with you. <clears throat> In all honesty. Um, I think it's time to get out. Profit take. And, you know, I could profit take and get a gold sub and a uh, something else like a bluesy. Hmm. Well, if you had a gold sub, why would you want a bluesy? Because I can. Yeah. I but would... you, you are right. You are right. If you had a gold sub, why would you want a bluesy? Yes, because I've always dreamed of having a bluesy. I owned one many years ago. I haven't owned one again. I want a bluesy. I want a bluesy. I want a bluesy. It wasn't that long ago. You owned the you owned the bluesy maybe four years ago. Three, four. Not that long ago. The two tone or the steel yeah. or solid gold. You had a one six six one three blues. No, no, that wasn't mine. That was my friend's. I just I just okay. picked it up for him. Wait, you're well, just no 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 no. You're mind blowing me. Hold it. You had a two-tone Submariner Bluesy 16613 uh, three or four years ago. You made, like, hundreds of videos about it. I don't even know. No, have that them. wasn't mine. That was the piano player, my friend. May I just say you, you duped me and every other. 
No, I, I, I never said it was mine. Are you kidding? I, how many no, I videos did you make about it? I, I, it was good footage. No, I, I used it, but he, he, he was the guy who had three two tones. He had a two tone Daytona, two tone GMT, and a two tone Bluesy. Uh, pre ceramic, just, right? Pre ceramic. They were all pre ceramic. Yeah. Well, you need one. I have one full kit. I bought one full kit because of you. <laughs> Steve Camasso, the Bluesy and the Calatrava is the way to go. How's that? So, what I'd do is I'd sell the world time. And I would buy. I tell you what, I'm thinking about buying. Sell the sell the world time. It's just so much money. Get a blue Z, which I've always wanted. That's always been a holy grail. Seven grand, okay. seven grand right there. Now you have twenty left. I was going to buy a five one nine six or a five triple one. Well, I do have one little. You don't question. know what a five triple one is, do you? I, it's, don't, it's a, I don't know my Patek references. I'm like Tan and Jin, who have nothing to do but to touch themselves slowly with lotion on the Patek. <laughs> you know, dot com. But I do have a quick question while you're looking that up. There was the small matter of a ten thousand dollar credit card debt. Yes. Yes. What about it? Well, you were planning on paying that off with the sale. Ah, fuck that. That's for losers. That's for losers to pay off credit cards. Yeah. That's the boring chick. That is the boring chick. Boring. Boring chick. Hey, that's what she does. She pays her card off. Wah, 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 wah. That's what she does. She's boring. Boring, boring. So let's have a look at a five. This is here. See, it's very Art Deco. See, look at this. What do you think you of that? you got to get the that's camera the... off me. Put, put the camera on you. It is on me. Okay. What do you think? It's a five. This is very, very, I love the. It looks like a Cellini Prince. No, no, no. This is a paddock 5111. Well, I'm just saying. This is, this is a, look, you like it in white gold? It's very Art square, Deco. Avoid I love it. Watches. Avoid square watches. Why? Because they're death. They're soft. They're soft, fuckers. They're soft. I don't it's care. Not. I don't do. I, I go against the herd. I, I'm, I, look at That's fucking beautiful paddock. Look at that. Death to your money right there. No, it's a gorgeous Patek Philippe. This is fucking. I want one of these, okay? Okay. Well, you're allowed to want it. No, but I, I could get one of these and get a bluesy for the same money. Hmm. I, how much is that? The 5110. We have a $2 super chat from John Galt who says, sell the tag, Pam, and Hydro first and then upgrade the PP. The I can't sell the fucking Hydronaut. You know how many inquiries I've got on the Hydronaut? Price, you just gotta, you just gotta, you're gonna have to take, you're gonna have to take it, you're gonna have to get fisted on that. Have you put it on eBay? Why don't you put it on eBay? I've put it on Gumtree. I've put I've it got, on my I've eBay. I, I hate eBay. I will not use eBay. I, know, eBay. I do I've not. Really Look at this. This is how cheap they are. Look at this. This is in US dollars. Smackaroonies! Smackaroonies! I, I think I need, I feel like I need Tan right now to talk you down from this square Patek, the unloved dog of the range. Look, you can get him for 12,000 US dollars. 13, yeah, look at this. Cheaper than that because these guys can't get rid of them. I don't really care. I don't buy things for other people. I buy things for me. Well, then buy it for $9,995. Get it under 10. I'm, all I'm saying is, I just think that could be a very, very cool Patek to have. What do you think? If you no, you don't it, like it. I don't. But what's a Calatrava cost? It's a simple gold Calatrava. Ah, uh, it's a little bit more. Not much more, but a little okay. bit more. And that, bit and that's, more. that's the icon of the range. It's the icon. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm just saying to you, what do you think? Should I say, hey, $2 Super Chat. For, oh, we did, did John Galt. We John did, yeah, Galt did, did that. I got to tell you, in all honesty... Oh, here I, you go. By the way, you know that Hydronaut? I got the links. I finally the links came in. The links came in. Full link bracelet. Um, Woody New Yorker, two dollar super chat. Mark buying from eBay. How can you be sure of parts? You can't be sure. It's a fucking lotto. It's a lotto of life, sunshine. So this is this is the Hydronaut. It actually fits me now, and uh, I. I it's, it fits. It's, 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 it's just so 
It's so ugly, it's cool. Does that make you sense? Know, that 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 could come back one day like thin ties. That that watch could yes, come back. Yes, thin ties. Thin ties. Did you save yours? I saved mine for like 20 years, and they came and went twice. And then I realized I had never worn any of them. I remember thin, in the 90s they came back. In the early 90s they were. I got to tell you, honestly, did you see my... my oh, Three dollar super chat from NV Scotsman. Heavy hitting. The Daytona is back on the wrist. Thank God, NV Scotsman. NV Scotsman. He's the guy who his fuckhead friends, his fuckhead friends said, "Why did you get the two tone? You should have got the steel." Because those fuckhead friends of his, they can't afford any Rolex because they're losers. <laughs> Don't listen to your fuckhead friends, NV Scotsman. However, tell them to uh, subscribe to this channel. Subscribe, like, subscribe, and tell their other fuckhead friends to come on as well. I got to take Marky. Did you see my? I thought this was a really good shot. What do you think of that? That's the ten-piece steel stunners. It's, it's a, a bucket of chicken. That's like a that's like a KFC bucket of chicken. Although, you know the um, that Burgundy Tudor. I'm I'm kind of after one now. I I you were talking about seller's remorse. I sold that one, and I have seller's remorse. Oh, I had the ETA one. I yeah, have yeah. My, mine's the in-house. The ETA yeah. one is much. Look, I think the ETA is cooler investment. The only thing I love about the in-house one's got faux rivets, faux rivets, faux rivets. Yeah. I like the ETA one because it has that little smiley face on the dial. I know that's so cool, so cool. I like I the. the it's also got a rose instead of a shield. I like the rose better. Yeah, I would. I, I have a big, fat, chubby steel fish of a Breitling chronograph that I would like to trade for um, any. Chubby. Bird. Here we go. This is chubby. This is chubby. See. Oh, that that is chubby. the weight loss begins look at the chin does, does it have does it have a pocket that shirt yes it does fine we'll keep it there I, i'm not going to rip this shirt up because it's only i'll show you this here it's only started to fray it's you know i um it's only starting to fray right it's only starting it's got about seven years left before it yes you haven't, it's got seven years left. That shirt has seven years of it's life. Seven left years now. left. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's, it's like a car with sixty thousand miles on the clock. I not even I, run in. I hear that your tailor committed suicide. Yeah, he tried I tried to. He tried to, but the rope frayed and broke. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta lose some weight. I'm fucking putting on the. I've just been comfort eating. I've just, it's just, just fucking terrible. Well, I have another question. Um, what? Have you ever considered? Have you ever considered getting a tattoo? Actually, I'll tell you this now. I actually wanted to get a Patek tattoo. Okay. I was thinking that. The Calatrava. Hmm. Where? I was also considering a Cartier tattoo. Well, I, because here's my question: Before we go too much further with this, and before you reveal too much for free, I think we might start a tattoo fund it will have to be expensive because it's permanent and it's expensive to get but what do you what do you think of a, a tattoo super chat fund it's like a separate no, slush. i i honestly i can tell you now I, I i don't want to get a tattoo well that's exactly why that's exactly why it has to be expensive now because Ooh, like no, this is social i can't be buried if, if, i believe if you're jewish you can't be buried in a jewish you're, cemetery you're, with tattoos I'm pretty, sure you're, I'm pretty sure you're not jewish pretty sure you know how but i know how about that yourself is that true or not I'm, I'm sure you're not jewish and i say that because i know that there is not a jew on earth would consider buying a square patek and getting stuck with a retail piece unable to move it i know so that's how i know you're not jewish it's me all right hold on i'm gonna, I'm gonna show you my uh I, anyway. it's gonna get ugly here fucker. it's gonna get ugly and this is for the first time ever who wants to see my tattoo how about a yes four yes, yes. So super chat Super chat. How, how much to show my tattoo? Five bucks. All right. Five bucks. Come on, guys. Five bucks and I'll show my tattoo. Actually, I've got... How many do I have? I have two of them. So, mm. so you yeah. see, that, that, that is a square, rectangular watch. That would, yeah, don't. but that's, that's an icon. That's the icon of the range right there. You know, I sold my JLC to the fat gent. What? I, I did. I had a master compressor diving GMT, and I, I sent it to Ireland to the fat gent. He's actually a very cool guy. He's lovely. We met in uh, we met in uh, uh, in Pattaya and had dinner. Um, yes, he, he's got a Thai wife. 
He does, and kids, and uh, so he he's goes. He's a lovely guy. He's a lovely guy. He's one of. He just is he still he, making videos? You know, he doesn't make them very often. I don't think he's released anything in a little while. And I, and I, oh, but that, I, I liked his stuff. I liked his honesty. I liked his story yeah. about how he. I remember watching one where he tells his story of how he decided to get this one. And come on, super chat. We want to see the tat. Just five bucks, and I'll show you my tattoo, people. Actually, there's two of them. I don't think we're asking for too much here. I don't think we're asking much at all. But keep no, oh, five dollars, John Gold. Show us the tat. Show us. Ooh. Ah, fuck! A dog paw. Yeah. Fuck me, dead. Was that any particular dog, or what was that? Well, if for my um, for my Doberman, my baby, my boy, my beauty. Yeah. Wow. And what was the other one? Well. I think that should be another couple of bucks. You know, we can't just another give away five bucks. If they want to see it, they can pay. If they don't want to see it, we've at least seen one. <laughs> I thought you were going to show me a Star Trek symbol. Crappy watches and cheap horse has offered me five dollars to put my shirt back on. <laughs> okay, so um, while we're waiting for the five dollars for to show off my other tattoo, which will be a lot anatomically. The next one is going to be difficult for me to show, but I will figure out how to do it. But I, I have to say, anatomically, mm -hmm. the next one's going to be a little. It's going to take some contortion for me. Yeah, for me, don't to get me banned on YouTube. Now I want to say to you, Marky, Marky, um, seriously, I think with the paddock, it's coming back from a service. It's going to be sealed in a sleeve. Don't open it. I, I think I'll just get rid of the fucking thing. It's too much money. I, I just yeah, bought it because it's crazy money. I, I don't understand. I don't understand all of this shit, to be honest. How with much you. is the service? Do, do we know yet how much that service cost? Yeah, yeah, it was fourteen thousand four hundred and fifty Hong Kong dollars. So put that in uh, American or Australian, at least. I'll do that. I'll do that. It's about two six uh, fourteen okay. four fifty. I'm just using xe dot com. Xe dot com is the conversion program that I use I tell you what it makes me sick so many youtubers there have product placements I was watching a video the other day fuck me dead these people Every, place me everywhere dollar, fuck shave, me now. dollar shave club is in everything man fuck me dead these guys who fucking promote <laughs> they promote the sh the dog turd on the footpath if there was money in it we've got ten dollars <laughs> John Suckerhorn who says okay it's up. 18 eighteen fifty well, oh my Ooh, God! Good job. Is that American or, or Australian? Uh, it, it is actually eighteen hundred American. Oh my God! Eighteen forty. That, that's what? That's two thousand dollars to service a watch. Um, no, John, no, hang on, hang on. Back the truck up. That is service plus a new seven hundred dollars strap. Ah, all right, but still, so it's like you know, yeah, it's still expensive, but it's not quite well, as bad. I, no, 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 that, that, that's very reasonable. Well, you know, Patek service. I myself have never had the pleasure of being double fisted. It's not much by... more than Rolex. It's not much more than Rolex. Hey, listen, we have a super chat for ten dollars. Okay, let's see both. Okay, let's see them. Come on, let's come Slicker on. He says, "Let's see both." Well, I've already showed the one, but now I got to show it again because. You know, John's paid the money, so he's paid really. the money. That's exactly mm -hmm. it. He yeah, has. So okay. So here's a quick look at the at the dog paw tattoo. Oh, and you, I don't know if you could see, but there's these little red marks under it. It's for my yeah. for my dead homies. It's, it's your for what? My, for my dead homies. For my dead dogs. For all my, you know, like I make oh. little marks. I, I'm shy a couple marks. I got to get to the tattoo artist and have some more dead ones entered there. Okay. okay, so that's that. Now, I don't know. This is going to be dicey. Ah, that's okay. Let me see how I can do this. Oh, it's the other foot. That's funny. I don't even know <laughs> what the hell. I don't even remember where the hell I've got it. This one's very boring. Can you see it? This showing up. What oh. is it? Well, you barely can see. Is it that so mark? There, hold on. We're experiencing technical difficulties. It's just a little band around my ankle. Can you see it? What does the band signify? It was uh, rain. The rainbow colors. Where the hell? 
Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, can you even see that? Is that yeah, show? That looks oh. like a prison tattoo. Is it a prison tattoo? You know, but <laughs> I was <laughs> in Miami and it was a real cheap tattoo. Uh, yeah, so more or less, it was done. It, it was done by Bubba with an ink pen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Did you see the guy who tattooed his eyes in prison? The whites of his eyes, he tattooed it black with ink, ink pen, ink. It's fucking crazy. Google that sometime, guys. If you want to see something really, really horrifying, Google uh, eye tattoo. And uh, multiple people. Zach have Owen says, "I want my money back." Sorry, <laughs> that is possible. Very sorry, yeah. John. <laughs> yeah, that's very. That was that was that was very good bit of showmanship. I got to tell you, Marky, um, hmm. do you ever get a watch and you think I'm not worthy of this watch? I avoid those. I, I, I get watches that are like under my worthiness level, not I mean, over. I mean, let's be honest there. When I fly on a plane, I'm usually in cattle class. Mm. Right? Ryan. I'm usually, you know, I'm not, I'm not at the front of the fucking plane. Hey, are you allowed to sit? Are you allowed to fly? It's like, you know, having, like, it's like having a Maybach and then being told you have to drive yourself. You are know? you? You have to wash it yourself with a bucket. Yeah, no, you have to drive it yourself. You don't sit in the back and read the Financial Times. You drive the fucking, you know, it's just, I don't know what to say. To fly, are you allowed to fly Thai Airways anymore? I'm going to give it a miss for a couple of years, then I'll, I'll do it again. Once, they, once, think, they have a, once they have a democratic government restored. Did you see what happened in fucking Saudi Arabia, in Turkey, with the Saudi Arabians? Okay, fucking so how? I got a... Woody Somebody. New Yorker, what $2 super chat? How much for Friday shirt ripoff? Where's that? I don't even see. Oh, there it is. Oh, uh, I'd, I'd need this to shirt, get it at least. Shirt, it's expensive. This shirt has seven more years in it, guys. So this is an expensive. Oh, no, I can't rip this shirt. This shirt's, this shirt's only new. I'd have to change Hang into another. Hang on a second. Everything is for sale, Archibald. Everything, everything is for sale. So, I mean, would you take $5,000 for that shirt? Look, this shirt was given to me by a certain YouTube celebrity. Really? Yeah, he bought me half a dozen shirts. Ah, is that one custom made in a foreign land? It's custom laid, but I put on weight, so that doesn't mean jack shit now. Yeah, but it's, uh, tight. It has, it's, tight. It's, tight. it's tight. It has happy memories and DNA in it, probably. <laughs> It does. It does. Look, the shirt. I can't rip shirts every week. I mean, I mean, well, no, you, no. You for fifth for the lousy fifty dollars you got last week. You cannot. But let me ask you, just as a point of order, okay? Sure, would sure. you take five thousand dollars for the shirt? I'd take a hundred dollars for the shirt. Well, there you go, guys. The 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 number is a hundred bucks. So who was it that asked the question? Woody. Woody New Yorker asked how much. The answer is a hundred bucks. There we go. So I know, I know we're going to raise that tonight, but if you want to mark your, if you want to mark your contribution shirt fund, we'll we'll keep a running tally. Exactly. Um, I got to tell you, Marky, what's given me? I got to be honest with you, my paddock. I don't think I'm paddock worthy. Are you worthy of having a paddock or not? No, I'm definitely not worthy, but but not for the reasons that you think. I am not. I am unhold it. I am unworthy because I don't have that level of knowledge and appreciation of horology. But you, sir, do. If anybody is worthy of a Patek, it is in fact the Ponte. Yeah. It's a financial thing for you, that's all. I gotta be honest with you. I've had some really nasty fuckers when I've tried to sell it. Some really low ballers have come in. Mm. That's the way selling watches is awful. And and I and I think realistically, I don't think it's gonna sell. I honestly, honestly, um, I don't think. I don't think it's going to. I don't think it's going to sell. I really doubt whether it will sell. I just everything sells. It will. It, in you know the super chat, John Galt, Mark. What's needed to go as AC three for Halloween? I don't even know how going. to do that. Um, I don't know how will I. How will I do? How will I go with AC three? Somebody's going to have to. I, you know uh, what's needed is the costume, John. That's the costume. The costume, the costume. Yes, we've got the pockets coming. I got to tell you, Marky, tell me this: you've been a bit of a flipper. Have well, you ever, well, have you ever wanted? I, mean, I saw your video where you talked about selling your entire collection and starting. There's something pure about starting from fresh, isn't there? Burn it down, burn it, burn, burn it all, and start over. Sometimes the only I problem think. is it's so hard to get Rolex again. You can't really do that, I can you? Yeah, I can't. 
except for I've got all this pre-ceramic stuff that I'm never going to wear. I don't know why I keep it just because you told me not to sell it. You said you never made, sell Rolex. You made a mistake on that Daytona, don't you think? Oh, yeah. Terrible mistake. About a $2,000 mistake, maybe three. Did you even like it? Nope. No, uh, well, it's not really a mistake then, is it? Yeah, but if I would have just thrown it and let it be a safe queen for, you know, 18 months, yeah. it would have. It's just about, I, I've got one friend who did a similar thing with an automobile. He, he sold a Porsche Macan S and bought a fucking Ford Exploder. <laughs> well, you know, I'm, I drive an Exploder and I wear an Exploder. Do you realize that? Yeah, actually, I kind of, I, I must admit, I got to be honest with you, I think that's one of the nicest looking watches. That white 42 mil is is yeah, fucking gorgeous. It, it's it's six two, six two. that's a bargain, don't you think? I think so. I, for whatever reason, I don't, and I don't, really don't understand why, but it is it is widely considered the dog of the Rolex sports range. Not and anymore, I, not anymore. It's starting to come up. Yeah. Wrist it's check, cool. wristwatch check is someone's wearing their... 1016. I'm wearing, I'm wearing, I'm wearing me Breitling, Breitling Super Ocean. What are you wearing there, Marky? You're wearing your Explorer 2. And I've got a Breitling for sale on the American version of Fleabay. I've got to go. I hate to do this to you because I know I really wanted to stay and work the tattoo fund and the shirt fund, but I'm afraid okay. I have a commitment. You must That's okay. Leave. That's okay. You've got a body coming in soon to the parlor. That's fine. Get that Get the good coffins out, wheel them I in. Do. I and, do. Uh, it's I 500 them. for a, uh, a bouquet, flower bouquet. That's very cool. Yeah, but we, we repossess it and we reuse it. Yes, yes. That's okay. Look, look, it's only going to be a short show. No one else has come on. Mm. Um, but, They're Mikey, right. thank you so much for coming on. You at least saved the show. It was sinking fast, and you, you came in. You came in. I, uh, I, I, guys, I really would like to see $50 raised for this shirt because this is this one's going to hurt. And as, as, as Archie, the pontiff, as he always tells us, it's got to hurt, fuckers. And this one is going to hurt for him to shred this, this shirt up. It's going to hurt. But he's giving you a very low-ball price, which is uh, $50. I think in the next Super Chat, conversation we really have to talk about a tattoo are you free tomorrow are you free on tomorrow come on tomorrow i'll be here, oh, like horse here. okay marky i will see you later thank you so much just hang on i leave you in good hands paul i leave you in good hands no, no, he, he wants to say no. something marky oh no oh, okay there oh no ask him something <laughs> anyway bad luck okay how, how are you Jono? <laughs> mate what's happening yeah what's happening uh are you okay everything's okay hey. Hey. i was gonna say to you Jono, do you think i should sell the world time yes or no give me your advice it's actually gone up in value so much so i was thinking about getting rid of it it's coming back from a service i don't know whether i liked your reaction the other day when you were asking me the same question yeah and uh I remained silent for a little while, and you said you didn't need to sell it. Yes. And, uh, and uh, it would be very hard to replace such a beautiful unit, especially after it's just, you know, come back, you know, after yes. a second. Yes. And, uh, and you said it's most probably more wise just to, you know, you know, put it away in the safety deposit box and don't even wear it at this stage. And yes. that, that was your, your comments at the time. Just um, put it away, um, yes. I think my response to you, I said, uh, uh, for what you bought it for and what you can get for it now, um, <clears throat> there's no need to sell it. You know, like, it's quite a substantial profit, really. You know, if you, you, know, if you want yeah, to... That, well, you have to realise the profit to, to, yeah. to get it, of course. You know, I mean, it's but, things... Uh, but keep the unit. You know, you, you, you'll, okay. never, you'll never replace it for the same amount of money you got it for. Okay, fair point. I got it. You loved it. I showed it to you in Melbourne when when I was yes. at the. Uh, remember, I was at the Sofitel. Remember that you you yeah. you, we, we, you were having a smoke with the, the windows didn't open. I don't know if you remember that. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. 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 Um, no, that's a very interesting thing there, John. Um, don't even take the don't even take the wrapper off, mate. Yeah. Yeah. Around. Okay. Okay. Yeah. That's that's cool. No, no point. You see. No. Yeah. 
no, 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 no. It's uh, it's all very good. Tell me this, John. Um, would you would you get something expensive for yourself now? Maybe. I'm oh, not particularly expensive. I'd still like a Vacheron. Vacheron. I've got, yeah. got to go on a certain, certain Vacheron, a certain year anyway, at least. No. How about a... Uh, are you keen to get the Mark II, the Mark II for yourself? I'm not keen. I've got other things I want to do before I do that. You've got money or buy a Mark II anywhere, won't you? Well, not anywhere. Oh, Mark II is actually quite hard to get now, John. Oh, you won't get them anywhere, but it, you should join the Jag Club and wait until some old bastard sells one. That's I am mean. a member of the Jag Club in in Melbourne. Oh, you are. Yeah, and so, you know, yeah, yeah. Is that Jag Club and something in England? Yeah, that's the original Jaguar Club, and, and then there's a Jaguar Club of Australia. Got all those badges on the front of my car. They look groovy. Yes, mm -hmm. they do. They look very grouse. Grouse is, John, you're supposed to use the word grouse. Groovy. Yeah. I used to groovy. hate that word. I used to hate that word as a kid, grouse. Grouse. Mm -hmm. That's, that's John's like word, everyone. It, uh, that's, that's, that's your word there. Um, John, I've what got to doing? tell you, what's yeah. happening in your room here? What happened to the Buddhas? You've taken them out. What are you doing with the room? I, I really like the train set. That's that was in the. I was originally in here. I had one originally in here, and, and I put that outside. And I made another one that wasn't originally in the, the dining room up the front. Yeah, but I've moved that recently. That's hanging out the back now. I think it's not set up. It's all pulled apart. I've had any fun. You know, pack it away. Bring it out to another tour. Takes up too much space. God knows if you had a HO, HO or you know like. You know, it was dead scale you put it on top of, you know, you put it in. Yeah. You, know, uh, you don't want it too small, but I think Z is yeah. far too small, you know. It's mm. too small. Yeah. But um, tell me this, Jono. It's uh, it's all going good there. i got to tell you, it's all going good. And uh, I'll, I'll be going down to – I wanted to see you in Melbourne. I'll be in Melbourne. Yes, yeah, yeah, we're doing that. When are you coming down? uh i'll tell you it's in november it's in november i'll be there um 7th to the 10th two weeks 10 days 10 days what midweek yeah. coming down uh yeah wednesday going yeah. back saturday afternoon Beautiful, very good. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, no drama. So yeah. I'm, I'm really looking forward to that. Yeah. Um, I got to tell you, Jono, it's uh, you know, it'd be great to see you. I'd love to see you. It's it's uh, I don't don't have a lot of time there. I'm actually picking up a a someone's lending me a Milgaus. Uh, do you know where Epping is? Where's Epping? Oh. Uh, it's north of Melbourne. How far from Melbourne is it? Not terribly far. 10, 15 kilometres. Oh, okay. I think, from memory. Not that far at all. Closer to the airport. It's closer to the airport. Yeah. Okay. Well, half the distance from my place. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Well, that's okay. Jono. Jono, it's uh, it's been a fantastic show here. It's been yeah. a fantastic show. We've had a lot of fun. I'm going to cut it early because I want to go. Yeah, good, yes. I got to I got to do a birthday party for my son. His birthday. Um. Yeah, I I uh, but look, Jono, it's been fantastic. We'll do another show tomorrow. It was great to have you on the live show. I must say that it was great to have you on the live show. Thanks, mate. Thank you. Hey, good and, fun, mate. Uh, no worries, Jono. I'm going to wrap it up now. Thank you so much for joining. This I like this short and sweet. This is very nice, short and sweet. Super. You got to go with the flow. Sometimes it's longer. Sometimes it's shorter. I think it was it was a good show. Jono, thank you so much. Good stuff, mate. Check you soon. See you later, guys. Like.